Welcome to Gotta Love Connecticut Hockey and the Pee Wee Tier 4 State Championship. I'm Ashley Leach coming to you from Bridport's Wonderland of Ice. Now before we find out which skills these Pee Wees improved upon the most this season, remember that a hockey camp or clinic is a great way to improve your skills during the off season. Check out the camps directory at gottalovconnecticuthockey.org to find your perfect spring and summer programs. These Pee Wees are ready for action. Let's go check it out. When your team wins a game, how do you like to celebrate? Uh, we go up to the goal and say, great job. We usually go back to the locker room and yell and scream. By blasting music in the locker room usually. Go out to eat or just hang out in the locker room after a game. We let the kids uh, dogpile and uh, sometimes the coaches dab. We swamp the goalie and cheer him on and there's a lot of screaming. What skill have you improved upon the most this season? Um, passing and skating. Probably one-on-ones on defense. Probably my slap shot. My Glove hand and shuffling. Eye hand coordination. Skating and passing. Pressure to the players when they shoot. What have you seen your players really improve upon the most this season? 100% uh, every shift. They go out there, skate hard, and have fun. Positioning, not chasing the puck. They've gotten much better at that, which has led to a good couple transition goals for us, things like that. They're starting to see the ice in ways where they didn't used to, and each individual kid has made a lot of specific strides to his or her game, and it's fortunately for our team added up to a collective better effort. There's 12 teams in this tournament. What sets your team apart? Um, we're awesome, and we pass and shoot and can finish. We worked well together. We're Great friends. I think how we move the puck and how we generate opportunities. We're a pretty small bench. We only got 10 skaters and two goalies. All the teams play hard, but I think our kids through a full season of skating with 10 skaters have the effort and the mental toughness every game they bring it. Well, our teamwork, we play really well together. And the better we play, the better we like are as a team. Goals. We're all really different, but when we come together, we're just kind of one big awesome team and it's, it's really fun. Once the season comes to an end, do you think it's important that your players play other sports besides hockey in the springtime? Absolutely. Tim Taylor, the old Yale coach, used to say, I want athletes, not just hockey players. So go play golf, go play lacrosse and see the field beautifully, go play some baseball, go swim, enjoy it. We encourage a lot of multi-sport athletes. It's never a problem to miss practices for in-season sports. At this point in the season, the expectation is that they're with us, but at other points in the season, I'm very accommodating of kids playing, especially soccer and lacrosse. Definitely, it keeps their muscle strength up, their reflex is good. Going out doing different sports, whether it's lacrosse, baseball, basketball, soccer, all great. So what's next for you as soon as hockey season ends? Do you play any spring sports? I play baseball. I run cross country at school, so that's it. I do a lot of tennis. Yeah, I'm going to do spring hockey and lacrosse. Yeah, I'm going to play baseball. I'm going to do some rowing. I have um, two lacrosse teams that I play during the spring and summer. This tournament is a great finish to these Pee Wee's amazing season. Thanks for enjoying it along with us because you just gotta love Connecticut hockey.